YouTube. In this video I'm going to just explain a little bit about creating beams. Now it's very important to create beams uh, or any other profile from left to right all the time. Uh, try to create the beams from the left side to the right side of your screen. This will help you <coughs> will help you when it comes to uh, creating your own drawing styles modifying it it automates things a lot easier if it's done from one end and uh, I know we haven't really talked about this but it's very important when you want to speed up the process of drawing and also make sure the position of the system line is always at the top especially in horizontal uh, horizontal members and in vertical members you want it to be at the end so it will be like on that side now <coughs> one other thing to remember is when you want to shorten a beam try it by all means to avoid using the drag command you can easily drag it to that midpoint there but again it's not it can be disastrous if there's so many things in the way try as much as possible to use example the uh, split command that what that does is just splits the beam at a certain point and uh, we pick that point there right click and then it splits the beam right away and another tool that is also very good to use when it comes to splitting beams or cutting beams you want to use this tool here this is the advanced trim and uh, what you do is you're gonna select the trim line and you're just gonna draw a line where you want to trim the beam so from that point to the end point there right click enter and that that last piece there is what you can select to uh, I'll just select it like that and then right click and uh, of course the member is trimmed right at the edge where you selected the line and uh, that's our little nugget of knowledge for today YouTube